কাজনাত আট আনক সরকার জেলা কাকাতফ্রা তরিক নফ্রা আর জার পুলাই কলা রাখি চিংাবফ্রা পুলাই সাম চিংলা ন উমলু সুসোথাম হা ক জে লং বালা পুল হাউ সুসোথাম অডিটোরিয়ম শিলং হা ক জে লং হা নি গি লাই দন লং দোবা এফ আর খারপুং কমিশন আন সেক্রেটারি কাতনাত কমু কংসন কপ্রফসা বা ডাবলিন ওয়ার কি বাহিং জং মুলু সুসোথাম কি খনা স্কুল নর কি বেপাত হাসুয়া কে কে জে লং কলাডন কচিং বুসন তিও হাও মন্ডল জং মুলং উবাদন হাফলাও কডিটোরিয়ম কুম কচিং কম বরম হেউ হা গানি গি লা মেখি খুসনাম সে খনা স্কুল কি ব্লা জব না কেজি কফে ওফে হাবা আই চিংক্রান কলং বৌ মুলু লিংবা কপুইট্রি এর পাত কি আউ উলাক্রেন ইয়াকলং কমান বমন তা খাম তাম হা কপাই দে বট কং খা খান্না বট মাহাম বট দে বট কন মাও সুহা পান থা ইক লং ইং লং সাম হাপ মানফেন খাম হালা কিচান কলা কদৌ রু বন কট কি বড় মহিন্য ট্রেপ উমল লুলাক্রেন সেফা কচাই হিমা কাপাম সাপ বট বুন কি পাত কি মাত চিং হা ইম লং সা লং কি বাই এম হা কিনে কি বমন When he appeals to the young people, and I'm very glad that there are so many young people here, the young students, probably all of you are in your teens. There is time enough for you to think about setting up homes, getting married, having children, and things like that. Let us listen to Usu Sotham when he warns us that it is it's very important that we have to be established before we can even think about getting married and having children and i think if we do that we will be able to remove a lot of difficulties social difficulties that our society is facing today so sudham also uh, has a lot to say about the political situation that he actually lived through i know that he was talking about certain historical events that had to do with the uh, traditional political institution political systems but some of the things that he actually had written in uh, his poems um in kisibrim unyukre he warns about the very fact that corruption is something that will ultimately destroy our society he talks about the need to be moderate the need to be honest the need to be truthful and the need to build societies and to avoid corruption at any level so so tham therefore is very much relevant in today's world his other works also in treater or treatment of nature while deeply appreciative of the beautiful and unique signs and sounds of nature of kastilan the poet recounts the horrific effects that nature can unleash on helpless puny human beings unless and until we also give the respect that is due to nature so whatever theme he chooses for his poems ussosa tham the great poet we find great depths of passion the power of imagination that soars high and a poetic language that flows effortlessly He, he reveals through his work his vast knowledge of world literary traditions particularly those of the english and of the greeks this can be witnessed by his reference to those great literary works in the preface to his masterpiece his nibarim unyotre where he compares the majesty of ulom shlong to parnassus the beauty of kalatara and the kurimai to helen of Troy and Penelope respectively his allusions to John Milton's paradise lost are relevant and appropriate such as his use of the name pandemonium where he describes the place where evil spirits gathered to plot evil designs on man initially and on god eventually taking the readers back to the time prior to the coming of Unyotrep into the world Tham was able to portray the innocence, the beauty of the land that was there before the pervading presence of evil started to see through and guided man away from his creator. And this is a warning I think that we need to take heed even today. The influence of this literary giant on succeeding poets has been tremendous, both in terms of his themes and his art. 
He lived only four years after the publication of his masterpiece. Uba FR Kangor, Kum Kong San, Haba Ajin Gran Ulo Ong Umulung Susotam, Ude Rangba, Kakato, Katar, Shakajan Rio Kasi, but Kuntu Yikun Samla, Banti, but what Nia Shapang Mulung. What we should do for the future in honor of Susotam is, I think, very relevant for us. A day such as this, perhaps we can think that with the next year, with the coming year, we need to perhaps have a literary symposium which is dedicated to the works of, uh, you know, of Sasatham. We need to perhaps encourage more translations, more publications, so that Sasatham does not remain uh, an unsung hero and whose greatness is not only limited to the boundaries of Meghalaya or of the Khasi Jaintia community, but his words, his thoughts, what he stands for should, should also be known to a far wider audience. So for that, we, we need more publications, we need more translations. We also need to adapt to the contemporary times. We know we live in a digital world and most of our young people, they source everything uh, through their mobiles. No one reads newspapers also these days. They all, they all look at the Instagram shots in the uh, you know in the news uh, you know in the news channels. So we we need to also leverage on that technology. How we can leverage that technology to make Sosotham and his work, his great body of literary work, more relevant. Uh, maybe I challenge some of the young people to make graphic novels about Sosotham. I also challenge uh, the literary uh, community to come up with more translations to come up with, uh, to, you know, to devise creative and meaningful ways in which we can honor and we can celebrate and we can uh, extend the, the, the huge body of work that, that Sosotham has done to make it accessible to a wider reading public, to a, to a, to a wider literary you know, uh, community. Why can't we think of having a retrospective on Sosotham at festivals like the Jaipur Literary Festival? Or even closer home, we had the Cherry Blossom Literary Festival. Why can't we have a, a section or a, you know, or a segment on, on the works of, uh, you know, of Sasutam?